Hi everyone and welcome to Web is Step Tutorials. This is Ahmad Fakhr and this tutorial about international phone numbers and PHP. In this tutorial, we will discuss how to validate countries' numbers with PHP, how to format phone numbers using PHP. Also, I will provide you with a MySQL database table for countries list with ISO code, call key, and the surprise is giving a placeholder or an example for every country phone number. Finally, we will use all these features with Google's free common library. Also, in the end of the tutorial, I will give Cognitor developers a gift, which is a library, how to use and install the Google free common library with Cognitor. Now, enough talking, let's go to the practice steps. Hi again, the first step is to install the library. To install the library, you can use Composer, which is a PHP dependency manager. There is many ways to download and install the dependency manager Composer. One of them, if you are on the Windows, to download Composer setup.exe and install it on Windows. After downloading and installing the Composer, then search for Live Phone Number. This is the library. It is a library for Java, C++, and JavaScript for parsing and formatting and validating international phone numbers. But we need to search the compatibility for PHP language. And this is the library. Here you can read about the highlights of the functionality then you can use the quick examples here you will find the integrations with the frameworks like um, symphony laravel and etc now let's try to install it here after installing the composer copy this line and go to the command line and paste here press enter it will take some moment to download the package from the internet then it is finished let's try to open the project here is the directory I will rename it to phone validator now let's open it when you open the project the first thing you see autoload.php this file is responsible to load the library using composer to load all the files here and autoload it I use this file to create another file which is demo.php and include it on top of the file then I make an example you have here many examples one of them this example let's copy it 
and try to use and let's open the project on the browser and open the demo.php as you see there is a result but the most important part of this result which is the national number or the example or pattern number for this country every country has a number pattern as example in Swiss you have one two three four five six seven eight nine there is a nine numbers for this country after the call key or the country code like the name here after 41 it should be like this number pattern and it is validate the pattern to match numbers with this pattern who should use like this library and this example you know you know it is upper let's see the example here is the example of using the library if you see there is the countries with the call key and when you try to enter the mobile number as you see there is the example if i want to insert a wrong number like this and press enter the phone number is invalid okay if you see if I press here there is a countries with flag and the name and the call key if you select any country of this list you will see the phone number the mobile number example exactly like what you will find in the database table now let's continue so if this pattern changed minus zero this mean wrong so the library could detect the wrong number i make a loop for all the countries get the national number save it on a table to give you as a gift in the end of this tutorial but before going to this let's try is valid number let's try to use it i get the parse for the number i put the code for the country which is ch and i get the swiss number proto put it on is valid number to test if the number is valid or not let's see the result yes it is true are you remember if i remove number it will be wrong if i increase a number like this it will be also wrong let's try to remove number and it is false okay let's increase a number and try again it is wrong so this is the validation for international number but before going to another functionality how you can get the country code it is very easy to load the country codes from the database and loop through it and build a drop down with all these countries could as you see here there is a table for countries you can loop through it get the code for the country the name in english the name in arabic the call key and the mobile example for every country for sure i will put this table on the github so you can download anytime you need it now let's go to the functionality that's responsible for formatting numbers let's copy the three examples 
First step is to parse the number. Then you can use it with any functionality like is valid number, format, and you can use another property to customize the number format. 164, this is the format that produced from using this parameter. Another one is to use national to get it like this. Another example is to use international to get or produce the example like this. And let's try again. This is the three formats. A geocoder, when I pass the number and the country, then I can use phone offline geocoder to get the name of the country with the specification for this language like English, Italian, Korean, and many other language. Let's try the example. Let's take one example. And it will print Zioretch. Then you can use a short number info which is a functionality to give about some information number as example if i pass is emergency number 999 and give the code for this country gb it will give true if i give 911 in gb it is not an emergency number, but it is in the US, it will be an emergency. So it will print true. 911 is an emergency number in the US. Also, and finally, another good feature is to put the number and the country code to extract the time zone for this number as example if i use this number let's try and print as you see it will give me the time zone for this number, which is Europe Zurich. Finally, I will put the full code and steps to use this library with Codeigniter in my plug. Steps, how to install the library. Do not make this video so long for you. Don't forget if you like this video to press like. You can subscribe to get the latest tutorials. If you have a question, leave a comment. If you want to recommend a specific subject as soon as possible, I will answer you. Thank you for watching. See you next. Bye.